Hi, it's G and Yanka from Amazing Parenting, and we'd like to talk to you today a little bit about perception and attitude in your parenting. Yes, perception and attitude. Uh, those are qu- two quite important words uh, or notions. Uh, we actually seldom realize how much perception creates our reality and influences our reality. Uh, but perception actually directly influences your physical reality that, that you're living. Oh, absolutely. The number one influence on students' results, according to scientific research, is teacher expectation of the student's ability. So your your perception, which essentially is your, your vision, is really important in your parenting style. I think you need to ask yourself, connected with your perception, do you do you have a vision? What what do you see in the future? Do you have a plan, a target? goal in your parents. That's true. Now the, the the mechanism how this works is basically uh, you have a certain thought and that thought creates a certain emotion. And we know uh, scientific study studies uh, show that our emotions have direct impact on our physical well-being and on, on our physical health. Uh, and we have complete control over our thoughts so basically the old saying think positive is not such a cliche as it may as it may seem because if you are positive and if you expect positive things to happen uh, even if you perceive critical situations in a positive light uh, you are actually helping yourself and you're helping the relationship with your child yeah I think you need to ask yourself if you are staying positive if you are keeping to the goals that you've set if you are keeping the promises that you're making as a parent to your your children and your partner um, i think you need to ask yourself how much accountability exists in your world as well so that if you don't keep your promises if you don't follow your plans um, who is keeping you accountable to that what are you going to do to get back on track i mean children are accountable to parents but who are the parents accountable to i think it's something that uh, parents definitely need to think about that's an interesting question okay and also connected with attitude as well Your, your attitude is really your position on on a topic but not just not just your your position we've got to understand that that it can be connected to your your verbal responses it can be connected to your physical responses it can be connected to the skills that you have and you, your attitude affects your your, your aptitude your, your abilities as a parent absolutely well. absolutely imagine a conflict right in a conflict your attitude directly influences your reaction right you can uh, you can see your child misbehaving and you can have the attitude you know oh my gosh he's acting up or he's at it again or you know he's just trying to be difficult uh, but if you remove yourself from the situation and you try to look at it positive uh, not positively objectively then you can maybe see that what you are perceiving is not a reality, but that the child is just hungry, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, or bored. So uh, how we you, have how's to. How's it going down there? Hi, <laughs> Jazz. There's, we no, have esca- to, there's uh, no escape. <laughs> we have to practice um, <laughs> identifying what is our attitude, what is our perception, and what is the objective reality of the situation. Yeah. The objective reality of the situation is that Jazzy has taken your glasses off the bed, <laughs> them thrown, the floor. thrown them on the floor, <laughs> and uh, oh, now she's put them back on the bed. Thank you very much. Yes. And um, it's. Uh, I, I think the kids are having. Let's make as much noise as possible. Yes. <laughs> so I think we better finish. So yeah. We're one finish. Aren't we? Oh, just one more thing I want to say. Oh, okay. Sorry. Okay. Say go that, ahead. Um, the, the asking yourself a question or, or even more questions as a parent I think is something that we should always <laughs> be doing <laughs> or using the bed as a trampoline which you can see is going on in the background here yeah ask yourself ask yourself as a parent are you open are you approachable are you fair ask yourself how do you know this how do you measure your abilities what 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 scale are you working on what are your rules what are your what, what are your borders um, try to develop good habits try to be constant try to be perceptive have vision and in your attitude think about what you say how you say it and try to understand what it is exactly and always look at the bright side of life right? always, always <laughs> on the bright side of the side.
<laughs> Joel, go. Yes. The bright side of life is on the other side of the camera where... Where she's jumping up and down, there being all go. crazy. Okay. okay. Well... One of the three. We... we, 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 we there you go. That's it. Do Thank you plan. very much. Okay. Thank you very much for listening. And we will see you next time again with Amazing Parenting. Yeah. That was all... <laughs> Bye. Bye.